A proposed law drastically limiting access to abortion now headed to Texas Governor Greg Abbott. Fox 26's political reporter Greg Grugan here with more to break it all down. Hi, Greg. Hey, Caitlin Rashi. No question this measure is a colossal setback for those advocating for a woman's right to choose. It is also a groundbreaking victory for those who say they're fighting for the unborn. Still firmly in the hands of Republicans, the Texas legislature has approved a statewide ban on abortions after the detection of a fetal heartbeat. Governor Greg Abbott has pledged to sign the measure, which will effectively outlaw the procedure beyond the sixth week of pregnancy. This bill says that little baby growing inside her mother's womb, uh, that should be the safest place, and that little baby is worthy of protection. She's helpless, she's vulnerable, she's innocent, and this bill says we'll protect that life when that heart beats detected. So Once implemented, Senate Bill 8, as it's known, will render the Lone Star State among the most restrictive in the nation, allowing just about anyone to sue anybody they suspect of enabling an abortion beyond the strict legal parameters set by lawmakers. Democratic State Senator Eddie Lucio crossed the partisan divide to support the tough new standard. Make sure that um, those um, soon to be born babies have a, an opportunity to be born and to live in our world and hopefully make it even better than we have it ourselves. But Houston State Representative Ann Johnson spoke for many in the minority at the Capitol who believe the proposed law and the restrictions it puts in place is based on a false narrative. Scientists will tell you that is not a heartbeat. That is an electrical induced flickering of embryonic tissue and it is not cardiac activity, but it is attack by unleashing a litigation mob on the medical community. And I don't know how we got to this point, and I am deeply disturbed that we are here. It bears noting that this strict new abortion law includes an exception when the life of the mother is in peril, but no such option for pregnancies involving rape or incest. Now, like similar standards in other states, the Texas measure is certain to draw heavy court challenges. In the newsroom, Greg Grugan, Fox 26 News.